Hello everyone. In this video, I'm just going to try to install the IntelliJ uh, ID in my new Mac M1 uh, with 16 gigs of memory. Okay, so I just did a search for IntelliJ download and I'm just going to go there, see what are the options that I have. All right. So here, over here, download IntelliJ IDEA and uh, it automatically detected that I'm using a Mac and what is telling me that I can either download the ultimate uh, which is the enterprise development environment or ID available for Intel and Apple Silicon and over here I have the community as well edition uh, for JVM and uh, Android development and it's a free open source available for Intel and Apple Silicon so this, this is the one that I'm looking for and making sure that it supports the Apple Silicon chip so I'm going to get rid of this and if you can uh, kind of look at the features, uh, Java, Kotlin, Groovy, Scala, you can develop that. You can develop Android. It supports Maven, Gradle, SBT, supports Git, SVN, Mercurial. It comes with Debugger. But then some of the other tools it does not support. Database tool, SQL, it does not support. Uh, JavaScript, it does not support. Swagger, uh, for open API specification, does not support. And uh, Spring, uh, does not support so uh, it's based on your requirement you can get either this or the that or or the community edition uh, this ultimate one is uh, free for 30 days now with the community one I'm just going to download the uh, DMG I'm just going to click on the drop down I don't need the Intel version I want the Apple silicon version and uh, it's asking me if I sh it, it should should allow the download from JetBrands. I say, okay, go ahead and allow. So let's see, the download is uh, going on over here. Okay, so it's uh, almost uh, 733 megs file. So it will take uh, just a minute uh, to be able to download. And then as soon as it's downloaded, we will uh, install it. Now let's see if you have any other uh, 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 installation guide so you can also uh, download the SAR 256 checksum and then once you get this file you can generate the SHA 256 checksum as well for this downloaded file to verify that uh, you have uh, downloaded the correct file and the file was comp downloaded in full uh, before you uh, uh, install it so if you're new to IDEA IntelliJ IDEA then you can go uh, in, a, in, in the discover IntelliJ IDEA guide uh, to see you know what's the capabilities that it offers you if you're looking to migrate from another ID like uh, Eclipse or NetBeans you can read up and even there are uh, video tutorials for this product as well so I think this uh, this is now done so I'm just gonna click on this DMG and uh, it's uh, opening up but finishing uh, right there so as like anything else I'm just gonna drag this to my application folder uh, my IntelliJ IDEA CE community edition and it says copying this and it it usually asks me to delete this file let's see if it that does or not still not doing it okay so let's just click on it and over here what I want to do um, I'm going to come back over here and just see if it's already available. Okay, so now uh, if I click on it, uh, let's see if it's opening up. And now it's, a, it's an app download from the internet. Do you, are you sure you want to open it? I say yes, buddy. I do want to open it. And there we go. So JetBrands privacy policy. Um, and I say confirm and to agree everything and then hit continue and uh, it's just asking about data sharing and stuff i'm just saying and i said don't stay send any of my data uh, and then expand the screen and uh, there we go i have the uh, intellij idea it's now fully installed in my apple uh, m1 chip silicon chip and now i can uh, do a new project and as I said, it supports all kinds of builds uh, just for a, a Java project. But if you see 
I do not have any JDK installed yet in the next video what we'll do we'll install the Java SDK and uh, uh, we'll set up our development environment but you have the ID installed and uh, it's ready to go so thanks for watching the video uh, if you like it give me the like button uh, subscribe and share with your friends thank you